How's it going out there? This is Coach Ty, and I'm here to bring you guys resistant band workout number four. So, no further, let's get started. Workout number one, I have you guys doing four rounds for time. It'll be 10 push-ups, normal or modified, 10 resistant band front squats using your resistance band tube, and 10 resistance band bent over rows also using your resistance band tube. Now, here's the caveat. Even though it's four rounds and those three movements, I want you guys to shoot to try to get this done within six minutes. So that means that it's about keeping the intensity high. That means do everything you can to try to get the workout done within the time cap if you're able to. That's the goal. With the push-ups, all the way down to the ground. The event you are not able to do a normal push-up Modified on the knee is just fine. Moving on to the resistant band front squats with our resistant band too. You're stepping on the bands, and pushing your elbows through, making sure your palms are toward the sky. And into my full squat, pushing my knees out and standing straight up. That's the resistant band front squat. As soon as I'm done with my 10 resistant band front squat, I can immediately go straight to my bent over rows. Shoulders are pinned back. Feel free if you're able to, to increase that angle, but do not let your back begin to slouch. Shoulders pin back, pull, release. Bent over rows. All right guys, this one right here is gonna be workout number two. Three workout of mitts, very simple rep scheme. 10 resistant band deadlifts, 20 sit-ups, and 30 mountain climbers. You're gonna be going through this three times. When we're doing a resistant band deadlift, there are, and what you're gonna do, you're gonna push your hips back while keeping your chest high, arms nice and straight, lower to your shin, and stand straight up, full hip extension, push those hips back, 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 down to shin, lower to shin, straight arms, and pull. Now, if you'd like a little bit more resistance for your resistance band deadlift, there is a way to do that. Let me show you guys. So, that looks like this. From here, I have a lot more resistance. Again, from the side, I'm focusing on making sure. Hips, arms straight, arms straight, hips going out, filling it in my hamstrings, and I'm pushing through, standing straight up, squeezing my glutes, straight down, resistant band deadlift. Once you guys are done with the resistant band deadlift, that is when we are immediately going into our 20 butterfly sit-ups. You're gonna take a seat onto the ground. We're gonna place our feet together. Start with our hands behind our head. Come up, touch our toes. Back, come up, touch our toes. From there, you're immediately gonna be able to go into your mountain climbers. With your mountain climber, plank push-up position. And we're gonna bring our knees all the way to our elbows. That's the mountain right, climber. Guys. And for the last workout, number three, you're only gonna need one device, resistant band tube, your choice of the weight and preference. We are gonna be doing a superset. Superset means I want you guys to get through all 24 of these movements without stopping three times each. Do not stop at all. So the first movement is going to be eight shoulder press nice straight body from here i'm going to squeeze my glutes and push my shoulders straight up kiss the top bring it right back down shoulder press we're going to be doing eight of those as soon as you're done with your shoulder press we are going to be doing eight lateral raises you're going to be starting with your bands down at your pants pockets and all you're going to be doing going up and bringing them right back down it's going to work our shoulders hands fully extended rising up so that we're parallel to the ground and going back down as soon as you're done with your eight lateral raises we're going to go right into eight bicep curls arms and hands completely straight down by our pockets upper back shoulders pinned back upper back nice and tight and all you're going to do curl and right back down notice nice controlled movement feeling good tension if you want to have to kind of fight to get that good pull and try to curl all the way up to your cheekbones and right back down pull, 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 and up. 
So again, three rounds, eight reps of each of those movements. I want you to do your best to do it without stopping. All through 24, then rest. Once you've kind of recovered a little bit, don't rest too long. We're talking maybe 30 to 45 seconds. Knock out one more set. Rest, 30, 45 seconds. One more set of all 24 movements straight. Push yourself. If you guys want to get the results, the secrets and the intensity, you have to put in the effort. Simple as that. Thank you so much for your time. Have a wonderful day.